couple of years ago, we celebrated the 50th anniversary of Purdue Christian Campus House, and it was this awesome year of collecting stories and memories and sentiments from literally generations of people who had been impacted by this ministry. The 50-year marker serves as this time of celebration and reflection, but also as an invitation to deep assessment and questions, curiosity and dreaming about what's next. Everything we do at Campus House stems from and flows into this mission of reaching, equipping, and mobilizing Purdue students with the whole gospel in their whole life for the whole world. That's our DNA. And yet as we think about the future, we want to seek the Lord's vision for what He has. And we're asking questions like, what is He presently doing in our midst? What is the culture like and how does it continue to shift around us? What does God have for the next 50 years, and what would it take to get us there? A few years ago, we began exploring the feasibility of a new home for Campus House, a place that would bless future generations of Boilermakers as well as the Purdue community and the city. This rather odd-shaped house that stayed in Waldron, though it is in an amazing location at the heart of campus, has been overcrowded in disrepair, and aesthetically challenged for several years. Through months of prayer and discussion and exploration, we felt God kept bringing us back to this. Building a new facility on the same footprint is our best option to effectively minister to this campus for years to come. Here are a few reasons why. We are out of space and consistently set up overflow seating for Sunday morning services. Even if a quarter of our regular attendees brought a friend, we would have no place for them. A new space would allow more people to participate in our worship gatherings, jumping from 300 to 500 seats. And it would be ADA accessible, which unfortunately is not true in our present space. The culture around us is rapidly changing and Campus House has become an equipping base for students to know Jesus and to live out the gospel in every square inch of their lives. A new building would serve as a hub of prayer and ministry as we make disciple makers, providing additional meeting spaces for Bible studies and small group discipleship, leadership training, pastoral counseling, dinners for international students, and much more. Being in the center of campus gives us a unique vantage point to help the church navigate the cultural landscape with the gospel. A new home would give us some permanence in an ever-changing campus as we mobilize graduates in their chosen fields to live and work from a kingdom perspective. Additionally, we would add a second Greyhouse location in the new space to extend the culture of warmth and hospitality and expand our outreach to the 10,000 international students from 120 nations. The mission field has indeed come to us. So this is the vision that's been stirring, and as we've been praying and dreaming, God has kept inviting us to trust Him and to see His faithfulness at work in every step of the process. Over the past couple of years, each obstacle has been overcome and each benchmark has been met as He has kept us moving toward the reality of a new space. And now, it's time. At each major decision point in our history, God has faithfully provided what is needed through our family of supporters. This is the vision for State in Waldron. This is the vision for Campus House. It's a huge step of faith, but God has already provided in breathtaking ways. Nearly $5 million of the 6.9 needed has been raised from just 200 families. We need your help to get the project to the finish line. Some of you have the capacity to really move the needle and we need you. But with that said, we cannot state enough the importance of every gift, irrespective of the size. We're asking everyone to think big, to think legacy. Our board, volunteers, and staff have stretched in giving and are excited to invite everyone to stretch and pray with us in solidifying this kingdom foothold on campus. We've been waiting for this. Now's the time. We have an undeniable sense that God is moving on this campus. If you share our heart and vision for future generations of Boilermakers, we would love to hear your story, but also invite you to join in on what God is building for generations to come. Come